So you may have seen her last year when she was crowned Miss Sangamon County Fair Queen back in 2023. Brooke Stabs is here on Marketplace and it's been literally one year since you've been holding the crown. So tell us how has it been so far? This year has been crazy. Mm -hmm. From the moment I was crowned, I hit the ground running because I knew I just wanted to invest myself into this position in the same way the Sangamon County Fair Board does with their positions. Mm -hmm. I have been able to attend numerous events, do numerous interviews, and the growth that I've just experienced this past year has yeah. just been astonishing. And I've, I've gained so many wonderful skills, such as gaining more confidence, my interview skills. I competed at the state pageant this year, which was so exciting. I met some of my closest best friends wow. who, I, who I know will be there for me for the rest of my life. So this experience has, has definitely just been yeah. once in a lifetime. Yes, I'm sure you've been super busy and just learning so much, but now we are in 2024. So what events are being held at the fair this year? Anything that's new being added or yeah. anything? This year at the fair, we'll start off Wednesday night with the pageant with the 11 beautiful contestants vying for the mm -hmm. title this year. Thursday, we'll have Priscilla Block featuring Connor Smith and Mark Wills the grandstand. Friday night will be the rodeo and we will also have mutton busting which was a huge hit last year so we're excited to bring that back again this year. Saturday will be the demolition derby and something new this year on Sunday is the car show which I think is going to be a great hit for Father's mm -hmm. Day. Yeah for sure. Now let's talk about the contestants with the pageant. 11 contestants this year yes. right? Yes. Tell us more about that. Yeah the we haven't had this many girls in a while now and it's so exciting to have this many girls come out and join us for the pageant because even them they've gained so many new skills that they haven't learned before and it's been so exciting to witness their growth that they, mm -hmm. they've, they've experienced and all the interview skills that they've learned which is to me the, mo the most important mm -hmm. part of this entire experience and I'm so excited for all of them and this week comes with many nerves I'm sure but they're so excited and yeah. they're just a wonderful group of ladies. And you know so Brooke right now you are in you're on the other side of it you're watching you know yes. and so what are some things that you've learned that you would like to pass on to these girls? Yes I would definitely say that this experience is fun but from the beginning, I always told myself, you have to put yourself first and be the most genuine person you can be. Although this is a job, you were selected for this position mm -hmm. for a reason. And to understand that everything you do, just handle yourself with grace, mm -hmm. be genuine, and be honest to yourself, because that was the biggest thing for me last year. Yeah, yeah. Looking back for you, did you ever dream of how it would be being queen? I honestly, I went into the pageant not having any expectations. Mm -hmm. I just knew that I had wanted to do this for several years, mm -hmm. so I wasn't expecting anything. I honestly just wanted to experience it all. And I remember the day that pageant was, I came in and I was like, mom, it's not going to happen. Like wow. nothing's going to take place. Like I'm just in this because I want to experience it. Mm -hmm. And then I heard my name and number get called and I was like, oh my gosh, this wow. is happening. Yeah. And again, I just wanted, I wanted to invest myself so much because I didn't have any expectations. So I, I just, I hit the ground running and That's I just, awesome. I took it. Yes, girl. And I, I just remember last year we were talking and, and just seeing it all come to fruition yeah. is just great. And so now come Wednesday, you guys are crowning a new queen. Yes. Okay. And so are people invited to that pageant as yes, well? Yes. The okay. pageant will take place Wednesday night at mm -hmm. 7 p.m. where you can come watch us and the 11 beautiful contestants. Awesome. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.